Prosecutors say 47-year-old Ernest Terrell Blackney set a home on fire last Thursday at 83rd in Vienna to cover up a murder. Police say he shot and killed Nakia Rogers, then went on a crime spree, stealing Rogers' car, torching his own semi-truck and three trailers, and then ditching her car in a field near 96th and Allen. On the run, Blackney found a man repairing large machinery here on the northwest side and told the man he was taking his truck, ordering him at gunpoint inside of this trailer here, locking him inside. That victim eventually pried open a side trailer door to escape and call 911. Tonight, police say Blackney is on the run in the victim's blue pickup truck. 12 News investigates uncovered he was in court just 10 days earlier where he pleaded guilty to sexually assaulting a 13-year-old girl. Prosecutors told the judge then they would recommend six years in prison and requested Blackney be taken into custody ahead of his sentencing. Instead, Judge David Borowski allowed him to go free, continuing his $5,000 bail without GPS monitoring. Generally, if they're going to go to prison, you don't want them coming from the outside and going into prison. Retired Milwaukee Judge Dennis Simple can't talk about this specific case, but says once a person has been convicted of a serious felony, it's rare they stay out on bond before sentencing, especially when the DA is requesting they be taken into custody immediately. After the, the guilty finding is made, they would tell me, Judge, we're going to recommend prison and therefore we want you to remand this guy. In that situation, how unusual would it be to not remember? Very. Well, Nick, is there any explanation for why Judge Borowski decided to release him? Well, the judge did email this afternoon to say he's bound by Supreme Court rules against commenting on an open case. However, we did obtain the transcript from the hearing. It indicates the defense attorney asked for time for Blackney to get his business and home, quote, wrapped up. Despite the objections from the victim's family and the DA, the judge granted the request to continue the bail and release Blackney, saying, quote, there have not been any violations or any issues while the defendant has been out of custody. Nick Bohr reporting live at the Milwaukee County Courthouse tonight. And police did just get back to us with a description of that truck Blackney is suspected of stealing. It's a blue Chevy Silverado 2500 HD pickup with the license plate DH21644 and a Zignego construction logo on the rear windows.